Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Windows 10 update error that is 0x8024034. So if you are receiving this error code while updating your Windows 10, then please follow the steps shown in this video. Now the first step is to run Windows Update Troubleshooter. For this, go to the Start menu, then click on Settings. Go to Update and Security. And then click on Troubleshoot. Then click on Additional Troubleshooter. Now click on Windows Update and then click on Run the Troubleshooter. And once the troubleshoot is complete, you can go ahead and restart your computer and then try to update your Windows 10 once again. Now still you are receiving the error message. In that case, you can go ahead and run this command. So open command prompt. So type in CMD in Windows search box. Then make a right click on command prompt app. Then click on Run as administrator. Click on Yes to allow. And then copy the command over here. The command is provided in the video description. Copy it and then paste it over here. Then hit the enter key. And once this is complete, you can close this window and then restart your computer. And after the restart, you can try to update your Windows 10 once again. Now still you are receiving the error message. In that case, you can go ahead and reset Windows update components for this. Copy this link. The link is provided in the video description. It will take you to Microsoft website. Scroll down over here. You can see download Windows update reset script for computers running Windows 10. Click on it. This will download the zip file. So click on the zip file, then click on show in folder. Go to the download location, make a right click and then click on extract all. Then click on extract. And then after the extract, you can open this folder and then make a right click on this file that is WU reset. Make a right click, then click on run as administrator, then click on yes to allow and then over here you can see the prompt says press any key to continue so press any key on the keyboard to continue and first of all it will go ahead and stop all the services then it will go ahead and restart all the services and this is how it will go ahead and reset the windows update components so let the process complete this process may take some time so it may take a minute or maybe more than a minute. So do not close this window. Let the process complete first. Now over here you can see it's restarting all the services and at the end it will tell you to press any key to close this window. So here you can see press any key to continue. So press any key on the keyboard. It will close this window. Now go to the start menu, click on the power icon and then restart your computer and then try to update your Windows 10 once again. Now still you are receiving you are receiving the error message in that case you can go ahead and run this two command the commands are provided in the video description so type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow and then copy the first command paste it over here and then hit the enter key on the keyboard and let the scan complete once this scan is 100 percent complete run the second scan so copy this paste it on this command prompt window once the first scan is complete and once the second scan is complete restart your computer and then try to update your windows 10 once again now the next step is to use windows 10 update assistant so you can copy this link the link is provided in the video description it will take you to microsoft website so over here you can see the update assistant so click on update now this will download the exe file run this exe file and this will load the Windows 10 upgrade assistant and it will go ahead and check for update. Now, if the update is available, it will show you the latest update and you, you can go ahead and click on update now. And after the update, your window should be up to date and you should not receive the error message anymore. Now, still you are facing the problem then you can go ahead and use media creation tool to update your windows 10 so on the same link on the same browser on the same link you can scroll down and then over here you can see media creation tool so click on download tool now and once the download is complete run this exe file then you will see this screen so agree to the terms so click on accept and by default upgrade this pc now will be selected so click on next and it will start downloading windows 10 along with the latest update now this process will take some time and once the download is complete, you will see the screen which says ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked. Now when this is checked, 
you will not lose any data on the computer so you can click on install and after the installation your windows should be up to date and should not receive this error message so one of the steps should definitely help you to get rid of this error so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel